This is still one of my biggest finds ever. Was this one right here? When you play the Viacom logo backwards, it says I am, and the zigzag is the signature. Listen. Now, Viacom doesn't sound anything like I am when you say it forwards. So backwards. I mean, so that's what it is. But I want to show you, watch, you'll see the you'll see the signature. Do you see it? You see the zigzag here? Now I'm gonna show you how this transfers over, how they hit it in military stuff. Because I'm actually putting this paint scheme on my airplane, but I'm gonna show you. You see the zigzag? Remember the I am? That's Saturn. That's the I am 911. Remember the video I just did? Now look, you see this? Remember it's a zigzag. I'm gonna show you how they pulled this off. Uh, let me get over here to it. That's right. You see, you think these are teeth. I want you to sit back for a minute, and I want you to focus your eyes and only on the space in between the teeth, and you'll see the zigzag. And that's why these guys put that on there. Not because it's scary looking. It is to the person that doesn't, is thinking in a different way. That's why, this is exactly why pumpkins have the zigzag mouth on them. Because it's the I am, it's the chaos, the terror, the scary bit. Here they disguised it. As you can see it's black and white. And it's the zigzag here. If we just take it, we'll just use the red. We'll just use the line. You can see it's a zigzag line. Because it's not the it's not the white part that you really should be focusing on. It's the dark part. And so they hide it as teeth. And so when we go back to this. Now you understand now you understand. See they just they just, they hide this shit in plain view. They hide in a plain view. Didn't you ever wonder why pumpkins had that zigzag mouth? Why do you, why do you look when you look at um, Charlie Brown? Why Linus? He has a zigzag mouth because all of these guys are in the know. They get it. You know the Viacom logo is probably my greatest find, and I'm the only guy that still is the only guy that's ever made a video about it and brought it to the forefront. Even though we have these other wonderkins running around that were born knowing every fucking thing, I guess. I think it's funner to learn than to know it all, don't you? Isn't it fun learning it instead of knowing it all? Because when you know it all, people don't like you. You might want to keep that under your head.